from when I was really young, I've always loved seeing how things work by taking things apart and putting things back together. I think I must inherit this from my dad. Between us, we must drive my mom absolutely nuts because we're always diving into skips and pulling stuff out, such as gear wheels, piston rings, and all sorts of metal things. We remake them and re-sculpture them into bits of artwork in our garage. My project for the Big Bang competition also came from my dad, and a problem that someone told about involving a remote mountain village in Chad, Africa. The village has a water well, and their problem was how to power the electric pump. They've tried solar panels, but the sun isn't strong enough to power in the early mornings and evenings when they need to collect water. And batteries don't work either, as they're always failing in the harsh, windy environment. So I absolutely love this idea as this is a real world problem that can have a positive impact on people's lives. So I quickly came up with this idea which I think is completely original to use a clock spring like those found in grandfather clocks to store energy from the wind. I created a model from my dad's collection of old metal bits and I had to overcome many different challenges such as how to turn the spring which is really stiff not just by the gear wheels but also through the fan. The most amazing part of my project was seeing with my own eyes the electricity being generated through the voltmeter. And that is when I knew it was a great success. This is only a model, but I can't wait to try and solve how to scale it up so it can be used in real life by the villagers in Chad.